So big day here at Maritzburg College then with the Volderklava Festival. And it brings the south up against the east with Paul Boys High up against the Glenwood. Ooh, nearly got himself into trouble. Managed to get it back to Corno for Mark, but that's not a good kick. He has a real chance here for Paul Boys High. Can they use? Oh, that's beautiful little in and out there from Ferlin Vers. And Paul Boys High get the first points somewhat against the run of play. Well, Corne for Mark here should have actually clicked to the to the close side, but he kicked to the open side and making a big mistake there, straight into the hands. Quick one, quick pass and a fantastic try. Thank you. Oh, there's another penalty accruing. Oh, excellent play. Uh, he has a real chance. Oh, and the pass just going a, a little bit wild there, but Chad Francois de Toy had done so much good work there from the number eight position. Captain, it just comes. started with a great handoff, showing some excellent acceleration. I think he could have made it by himself there. And trying to give the offload, I think he should have gone by himself. He would have gone over with his speed and momentum, he would have gone over. Up from Quasi Kiniele. Now they're using the width of the field this time, Glenwood, and found some space with for Mark. That ball was knocked down, yes, still, and there's a try. It will be awarded. Kululakon Kuma, I think, is the man who will be credited with that try. Corner for Mark. The ball definitely got hit down by the number 14, Daniels, and Nkuma picking it up and going over for a fantastic try in the corner. Glenwood needed that. They needed to get back into this game. It started from a penalty. They kicked it out, got the line out, maintained their possession, and then played really wide and went in for a fantastic try in the corner in Kumo. So will it be fourth time lucky for Kone for Mark? It's not an easy kick. You won't be troubled by the distance. All the direction. A vital kick for his team. Brings them within three points. The rugby season's got a long way to go still. Oh, his team will be needing him now. This is where they're holding on to it and looking to try and drive it up. Here they come. Is that a try? Yes. Rickus Verhoeven has uh, awarded the try. Looks to me like it was Thomas de Toy there. It was. From Paul Boys High, the big number one prop, the loose head prop, showing awesome strength, awesome leg drive. Well, they backed themselves, didn't they? They said, look, let's take the line out, let's work our way up. We've got the strength. And there's no questions of illegalities around that with Thomas Tutoy. No, definitely not. He's, he's done very well, the, the young lad. Showing some awesome leg drive, strength, and going over for a fantastic try for his, for his school. Just have a feeling that might be a tipping point for Paul Boys High, too. If they get this over, up to 17 points. Oh dear, kick it. You've got to kick it quickly. <laughs> there was a huge charge there from the Glenwood boys. And how often do you see a charge down? It's very much the latter. Glenwood have done well. They've got themselves well positioned, but that mall has collapsed. No, they're still staying on. He has a chance for them. That is going to be absolute touch and go. Now, bear in mind, we do not have a TMO here, so we're not able to view that and make a decision thereafter so the decision's been made and i'll tell you what that could be very marginal this one there's no problem with him touching the corner post well you don't want to give away penalties in the last couple of minutes now can somebody kick this distance would be the next question it's maybe the one last opportunity that glenn would have absolutely Snatch victory from the jaws of defeat. There was no issues. No issues at all with the distance. He has been such a hero in the second half. Has Corno for Mark. There's a huge amount of frustration there, Vim, I'm sure. Uh, definitely. But I have to say that is a well-deserved victory for the courage and the character that they showed. And one has to say, really, that... Paul was I would have come into this game probably as the favorite but they ended up losing this game by 17 points to 15.